Hi everyone! So, welcome to Eileen Huga Yoga. I know this is a different type of video for that we're gonna do today, but wala lang. Feel ko lang. So anyway, for those who doesn't know, uh, I, I was actually a makeup artist before I became a yoga teacher. That was my career for like eight years. So now, when I put on makeup, hindi na siya yung parang parang magshooting te. San pupunta? But I actually just put on makeup para lang. I don't know if you're gonna attend a birthday party or you're gonna meet some friends and just to have just to look respectable. Respectable talaga pa. <laughs> Hindi kagalang galang. But also, um, but I don't usually put on makeup when I teach unless for those students who saw me wearing makeup. May pinanggalingan ako at may dahilan ako bakit ako naka-makeup nung time na yun, okay? This is not an ad for any brand, but I'm just gonna show you some stash of what I already have from my make my personal makeup kit, okay? Um, you start with moisturizing first your face, so I already put on a moisturizer. And then, if, if it's a special occasion, then I put on a primer. I know wala masyadong special occasion ngayon, but why not kung makikipag-dinner ka sa iyong hobby or sa iyong boyfriend na, or sa iyong partner, so medyo siya shake natin ng konti. You have to shake your product um, before you use because a lot of the time, especially now that it's hot, you need to make sure the products are, blend, are properly blended inside. And then you can start applying. This is a color corrector from. Sige, gawin natin parang blogger H and M. Yeah. So a lot of the stuff that I actually use for my face, um, very reasonable na siya. Hindi na ako masadong brand conscious. Kasi mo kaka naman siya. Dati ng makeup artist ako. Super buy ako ng mga super expensive na mga makeup products. But because yun ang pinagkakakitaan ko. So, pag bumibili ako dati, picket mata na lang. And, here's my card. Ganun. Pero ngayon, um, that I've become more practical in life. <laughs> and being a yoga teacher is not, you know, it's a simple job. It's a simple way of living. So, I just buy what I really need. And then, just make the cheapest one or it's not cheapest but at least it, it fits my skin okay so this product it can be good for you or it can't be good for you so how would you know you have to try it okay so usually when I, I um when I try a product I go to the store I try it on make sure you have clean hands when you try products on in the store and then you have to ano ba? After trying it, you have to walk around before buying it. So you know how it reacts to your face. Or you don't have to buy it immediately that same day. You use it, wear it, and then tomorrow or the next following week, come back for it. Oh, yeah. So I'm actually applying a lot under my eyes. So color correction siya in peach. Okay? Because of my skin tone. Um, you can Google actually what peach color correctors are, but usually it's to correct the under eyes, the blue tones in your skin. There. All right. And then after that, I usually proceed to my liquid foundation. H&M. Obviously, isa, isa, ano, isang bulto ko lang siyang binili. Tapos, yun na. And then, because we haven't been going out, and I usually... Do wakeboarding. <laughs> Ang itim na ng foundation ko. Hindi na siya bagay sa kulay ko. Pero, don't worry guys. May style dyan para lang pumantay-pantay yung mukha mo. <laughs> okay. See? Okay. So, hindi tayo masyado nakakalabas ngayon. Kaya wala tayong masyadong color sa balat. So, I just put on my foundation. Ayan pantay itong ginagawa natin. <laughs> Parang hindi makeup artist. Ano ba yan? So, I just put on anywhere. Lalo na sa sides ng nose. And then, because I'm always under the sun, 
if you're gonna go under the sun make sure you put sunblock but since i'm always under the sun before when i when i do my water sports i have a lot of freckles but sabi nila maganda daw ang freckles pero malala na yung freckles ko at saka aging na yan guys i'm turning 40 this year so marami, marami na akong age spot siguro yan okay and then cover here more there Ayan. And then just blend it with your finger. So once you're able to apply it, the more that you rub it intensely, the more na natatanggal lang yung product. But once you put it on, start like pat patting it like that with just your finger. Here. Ay, ang pangit lang kibay ko. Ano ba yun? So dahil na lockdown tayo guys, ang mga kilay... I know, uso ngayon yung pakapala ng kilay, pero parang hindi naman siya inayos na ma inayos talaga. <laughs> parang tumubo lang talaga siya dyan. So anyway, so you put the, especially you put on the parts that you think there are a lot of discolorations. There. In fairness. Okay, so medyo malayo siya sa akin. Leg. So, ang ginagawa ko, minsan, naglalagay ako ng konting-konti lang. Okay, but if you're gonna wear a white shirt, I suggest do not put on your neck. That's why it's, it is nice to buy the color for your, the right color for your skin tone. But since, wala na tayong ibang liquid foundation, kanina yung nandyan, diba? So, pwede na rin. Pagtsagaan muna natin ito, guys. Ha? First time. Okay. And then, after putting on my foundation, um, okay. What type of foundation do you use? Dry or uh, if, um, this one I like because I'm, I'm starting to have dry skin kasi tumatanda na ang lola nyo. So, I like liquid foundation nowadays for me because cream makeup seems to, um, change for me already. Oh, I forgot. Okay. Usually, before I start putting on makeup, oh no, where is it? I start putting on a lip balm. Oh, there it is. Okay. Put on a lip balm. Para na moisturize na yung lips mo. Habang mini makeup ano yung sarili. Okay. Check natin. Okay. And then, concealer. Okay. Alright. So, yung concealer ko ngayon, maitim na rin siya for my skin tone. Hindi na siya bagay. So, I'm gonna use two concealers for me right now. I'm gonna put on a, a liquid concealer first. Let's see if it's still okay with my skin tone. This is also, what is this? Uh, H&M. All right, so I'm just gonna put on here. Oh, why did I, why did I buy a lot of H and M? Um, I feel like oh, because it's um, uh, conscious makeup there. So they have a conscious makeup, but their makeup is conscious, meaning they didn't use it for animal testing. There and then, napadaan ako sa H and M. So bumili ako. So, here, I started putting, I'm pretty bad. Marami, malaki yung eye bags ko. Kita niyan. So, when you put concealer, make sure you put it under the eye bags. Don't put any more on the part na may eye bags kayo. So, nasa ilalim ko lang siya nilalagay. Dun sa part na sunken, yung malalim lang. So, dun mo siya concentrate Tapos, pag blinin mo siya, tap, 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 tap lang. And then, blend it like that. Huwag mo nalagyan dun sa may baggy part. Okay. Now, if you see, if you notice, hindi pa siya masyadong coverage for me because hindi na nga siya yung tamang kulay for me. So, this isn't there. Plus, Normally, for those, um, I already chose makeup na hindi masyadong full coverage dahil hindi naman naaaten sa shooting, ba? So, yung sakto lang, yung may konting coverage lang. Okay, so, konti ng 
cream concealer just to this because my cream concealer it's a crayola uh, it's just that ay ang kapal okay ang cream concealer makapal siya guys so a little goes a long way yan if you have those sponges go gamitin niyo ang mga sponge niyo pero ako parang masaya na ako sa finger finger lang at saka wala akong nakuhang sponge because I'm not stay at home right now so hinablot ko lang to kanina sa bahay okay there okay now I like the other one more so you already have that under the eye you also put under your chin. Konti lang. See? Diba hindi mo masyadong malayo dun sa foundation. And then, kung gusto mo ng konting nose. Yeah, konti lang naman. Okay. And then, shake. And then, like for me, I'm already turning 40. Nagkakaroon ako ng lines dito. So, lagyan natin ng filler filler talaga. Lagyan natin ng filler dito ng concealer. Ng concealer. Concealer. Okay. So, once you put that, there. Pasok pa ba? Parang may hindi pantay. Itong part na to. So, you always have to check not on the camera. <laughs> on a real mirror kung saan yung mga hindi pa pantay. Ang daming blemishes ng lola nyo. Kailangan na magpa-derma pero wala. Lockdown. Okay. Alright. Now, after that, I set under my eye. So, same thing. Careful when you set under your eye. It's a Japanese brand powder. So, I usually just set under my eye. Kasama na siyang sponge. That's why I like it. Tapos, samaya na natin siya i-blend, guys. Yung sa ilalim ng eyes, mayan yun na i-blend. Ang tawag daw dyan, baking. Parang nung may nagtanong sa akin, do you bake? I don't bake. Diyos ko, ang tita, hindi millennial talaga. I don't bake. I just love to cook. Kamusta naman yun ng makeup artist? Hindi alam. So, nung time ng makeup artist ako, wala kami tinatawag na baking, baking. Mga recent ilang yung naglabasan sa mga vlogging. Pero, baking pala ang tawag dun yung parang binababa dun ng powder. So, we usually put that. What's the reason of that? So, because when you put eyeshadow on, on your eyelid, there. When you put eyeshadow on your eyelid, when it falls down, at least there's powder and it won't stick towards your, it won't stick on the skin. So usually I put a lot under the eyes so that you can brush it off easily later. After putting on the, after finishing with your eyes. So that's the reason of that. But apparently, my purpose na daw talaga siya. Ang tawag daw ay baking. So hindi ko alam yun. Um, aminado ko. Lumang luma ang dola nyo. So, Alright, now, I usually start, pababa tayo. So, from the eyebrows, going down. And, oh, I love this product, Nichido. Because, I've tried other um, eyebrow shaver. And, this one is actually cheap, but works. Okay, I like it because it's sharp enough to remove the hair. The stray hair. So I just removed the stray hair under I'll go ako makeup artist. Okay. I actually did three movies with the beautiful Rufa Gutierrez. Hi Rufa. Um Yeah. I did a lot of uh, movies with her. Uh, I did a lot of doing makeup for her. And yeah, and TV shows before, and I do a lot of, I shoot also for commercials. Okay, wait, guys. Balik tayo dito sa ginagawa natin. So, pag, na, pag nalinis mo na ng konti yung ilalim, 
wag niyong ninipisan. So, don't try to reshape anymore because uso na ngayon ang super kapal na eyebrows. So, I try to get a clear gloss. So this is actually from Bloomier. It's also a lash and brow serum. But I always already use it as a eyebrow gel. Actually, mamiya ko na siya gagawin. Unahin muna natin ang paglalagay ng pencil. So, this one, my pencil. And usually, I share it in my Facebook or in my Instagram IG story. If I like a specific brand, especially for those who already knows me that I used to be a makeup artist. And this one is actually pretty cheap and it's still, I'm still using it. Um, what is this one? This is Etude. Okay. And a little bit of gray. So you notice that I tried to fill in those spots first. And then when I try to fill them in, very, very light stroke lang. Hindi kailangan perfect. Hindi magsushooting. Hindi sisilipin sa camera. Yan. So, I try to fill it. Light stroke muna tayo. And then, you can start darkening the edges. Start with the top. Ah, kapal. Di na magaling magkilay. Anyway, mukha ko naman yan. <laughs> so, it's been a while that I actually put on makeup. Hindi na ako sanay. When I put on makeup nowadays, I just put on blush and... Ano ba? Blush on lang. And then lipstick, that's it. I barely even put on foundation. Pero, meron ako kailangan picture today. At meron akong shoot na video. Kaya medyo kailangan bumongga daw ng slight. Ayan. So, this one, mas putol yung kilay ko dito. Hindi ko alam bakit. Baka naahit ko siya ng mas bata-bata pa ako. Kasi dati nung 90s, panipisa ng kilay nung college, diba? So, you should look at your old... And then, try to darken the ones there. But then, the ones that are don't need darkening, just try to glide the eyebrow pencil on top. Pero may mga parts na butas talaga. Go ahead. And then, sometimes you can just use the brush. There. Hindi marunong mag-video talaga ng makeup. Sorry guys, kinakausap ko yung sarili ko. So my boyfriend actually was laughing at me. He was like, oh my god, you now have a new best friend. At okay lang yon Sa mga panahon ngayon, kailangan natin pasiyahin ang sarili. <laughs> Alright there. So once you've already fixed it, I actually haven't used this. But I'm not gonna use it. Okay, skip that. And then I used the Bloomier Eyebrow Gel. Hi! Joyce, I'm using her product. Okay, so here I'm applying it. Oh, so daw kayo yung ganang ganan paguluguluhan ng kilay. So just swipe it up. Swipe up. Ano to? Cell phone. Swipe up your eyebrows. Yan, halatang hindi na sa. Hindi talaga marunong sa language ng mga baguets ngayon. Okay. So once you finish your eyebrows, I try not I try not to make my makeup too complicated. Hayaan na natin ang relasyon natin ng complicated. Okay? So di ba sira na yung case ko but at may mga nakakahiya ipakita sa camera. But yeah, this is my makeup, my MAC. MAC palette. Just use a brush. Huwag natin masyadong bongkahan. I just use a little bit of... Mahilig ako sa shimmer, guys. Na natural color. Okay. Shimmer of natural color. From MAC. So, I just put... So, same thing. Pat-pat muna natin yung eye. Yung ano. On the inside. Yeah. On the lid. Napakaluma ng style ng pag may makeup. Okay. Guys, kung napaka old school ng pag may makeup ko, 
malabas sa old din ako. Okay. So, hindi na ako nag-makeup at hindi na ako natuto ng bagong trend. Okay. So, I tried putting on like shimmery on the inside. So, I like that because it gives my eyes like that opening. So, tapos konting matte cream I put here sa my eyebrows. Eye eyebrows. Sa ilalim ng eyebrows. Kunti lang ha. Huwag na masyado kasi hindi naman tayo pa party eh. Okay, there. And then, I like going for new tones nowadays. And a little bit of brownish. At mahilig ako mag-mix, mix, mag-dab-dab mag sa iba-ibang eyeshadow. Tapos nilalagay ko lang dito sa me fold ng eyebrows. Ay, eyebrows na naman. Eyelid. Check. And then because I'm getting older, so if you're turning 40, 37 to 40, and your eyes sometimes start to droop down already, I suggest, wag masyadong lalagyan dito sa dulo. I suggest make an opening by just lift. Try not to create those inside anymore. Pag pagets, maganda pa yun eh. Okay. And then, go to the opposite. So, it's a lot of the style of the makeup that you should be doing is to open your eyes already. Especially if you're turning 40. Tanggapin na natin to guys. Okay. Iba na yung pag may makeup natin ngayon compared nung baguette style. Hala nung baguette, super smoky, smoky ever. Yan. So, pag medyo nagkaka-age na, try natin yung light-lightan lang. Just sa jasahan lang ang effect. Okay? Lash curler. Curl lash. Well, this lash curler is very, very old. Make sure that the garter is still okay. When you use your lash curler, you don't want your lashes cut up. Okay. Sinatakot ako bigla. Kasi guys, matagal na nga ako hindi nag-makeup. Literally, ang makeup kit ko nasa baul na siya. Okay. And then usually, if I have an eyebrow eyeliner, a cool eyeliner. I put it in, I put it in just to soften the edges. But since I don't have that, and I didn't bring my small brush. Did I bring my small brush? Okay. No, so limited ang mga brushes na dinala ko ngayon dito para mag makeup. Sabi ko, huwag naman karirin. So, what I only have is my liquid liner. Um, this is the Clio Kill Black. Um, ginugal ko lang siya nung may nagpunta ng Korea tapos pinabili ko. Okay. But I know there's a lot. I know that this is locally you can buy this already. Especially sa mga online. Ah! Oh, oh. Ayan. Ingat kayo. Huwag niyong iipitin ang sarili niyong balat. So usually, ako, dami kasing hawak. So usually, when I put on my makeup, I lift my eyebrows kasi nga nagdo-droop na ang mga balat. Wala naman tayong pang botox. Lift my eyebrows and then open your eyes. And then that's the time you squeeze. Tagal ko nang hindi to ginagawa. Yung pag lash curl. Dahan-dahan. Baka maubos sa mga ang mga buhok sa mata. Alright. Now that you have that, um, then you can put your eyeliner. Okay. Medyo nakakatakot. Yung pag nag eyeliner ako, guys, I really lift my eyes. And then you'll see those under the lashes. Okay. Iiyak ako na ito kasi matagal ko na itong hindi nagagawa. So, isipin nyo na lang. Nakipag-break ako. Pero wag, wag natin sasabihin yan. Baka magkatotohanan. Okay. Game. I try to put it as close as I can towards my lash line. Okay. And very, very thin. Have you ever seen your face when you do your eyeliner? Like, at may pag-exhale. So, may pag-yoga pa rin ang ngayari, ha? 
nag exhale mas relax ang muscles. Oy, may science daw yon. Okay. Maiyak kaming ginawa akong yun. Pero, sabi nga nila, tiis ganda. Oh my God. Mas makikita naman ng students ko mamaya. May online class ako. <laughs> Parang naka-makeup si teacher. Tapos, sa dulo, it depends on your, the shape of your eyes, okay? Yan ang mahirap lang pag liquid liner. It's a right minus wrong kind of makeup. There. Ito yung shape. Alright. Okay, kita yung difference ang eyes. So, parang kahit walang lashes pa yung kamila, bongga na siya. Buhay na buhay na. Okay, palipat tayo sa kamila. This is not my perfect side. So, my perfect side talaga. May perfect side. May... It's easier to put on the right side because I'm right-handed. So, when I go to the left, ang hirap niya. Mahirap talaga. Effort siya. So, Dali ba ako sa mga tao? Mas madali talaga mag-makeup ng ibang tao kaysa mag-makeup ng sarili. So, sa mga tao nag-makeup araw-araw at na-perfect na nila ito, ay, saludo ako sa inyo, guys. So, parang yoga lang yan. Makeup is practice. Kung hindi kayo nagpa-practice mag-makeup, katulad ko ng matagal na, nawawala ang touch. So, Dali. Medyo concentration ito ng bongga. Kasi eh, kuya. Kaya ito po yung nangyari. Iniwalayan niya ako. Charat! Okay guys, naiyak lang ako. Ito yung magulo. Ayan na. <laughs> Bumaba na yung ano. Ah! Huwag tuwalya. Cotton buds ang katapat niya. Ayan naman kasi. Feeling kasi professional. So, hindi handa. Walang cotton bud sa tabi. So, pag naiiyak na kayo, dahil sa maraming bagay sa life, mag-cotton buds ka. Para, kasi po, kuya, ganito na nangyari. Yan. Tapos, breath in, breath out ka lang. Yan. Okay. Look up, look up. Blink your eyes. Ayaw pa rin to Miguel. Tapos hindi tama si Joke. Walang ganyan. Dry up your eyes. Hello. At saka ngayon guys ha. Sa mga makeup artist. Hindi na pwedeng. <laughs> iihipan ang mata. Kaloka. Ang virus. Delikado. So. Q-tips. Okay. Q-tips to clean. The tears. Okay, tapos sabihin mo sa kanya, huwag ka nang iiyak. Ganun. Okay. Pero kung sarili mo yung sasabihin na huwag kang iiyak, ang hirap, diba? Humugot na naman ako. Okay, game. Okay. Stand by lagi ang eye. So, once na start ng umiyok, ayaw nung tumigil yung eyes. Okay lang yan. Sensitive eyes. And normally... Normally, sensitive eyes means it's tired. Especially now, ang hilig natin tumutok sa mga mobile phones, di ba? Kamusta naman ang mga mata? Ako, lagi ko nag... I've been experiencing a headache because of that. Okay, at saka, in denial pa ako na kailangan ko mag-eyeglasses. Pero feeling ko, kailangan ko na mag-eyeglasses. Okay, konti na lang. Konti na lang din, tutulo na naman yung luha ko. Oo, ang hirap talaga ng eyeliner. Ah, parang dyan ako tumitigil lagi. Tapos may cry-cry ka pa. So, when you wipe on the top part, make sure you follow the shape of your eyeliner. And then start drawing the cat eye. At, ito na masasabi ko guys. Minsan, ang kanan at saka yung kalawa, hindi talaga pantay, ha? So, try not to over-criticize your, 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 the face, the symmetry. May mga, may mga iba talaga, perfect ang face. Pero kung hindi, okay lang yan, okay? The makeup is there to enhance the 
face but try not to change your god-given beauty no there okay hindi siya perfect pero okay lang yan all right from there pag na kawama na yung eyes yan. if you feel that you need a more dramatic look then you can choose another shade of eyebrow. But usually ako ngayon, less is more. Parang normally, ano na lang ako, two colors, one light, one brown. This, yung two colors po, hindi talaga two colors yun. So I try to dab it in different colors. And then kung saan siya maganda yung effect, doon na siya. And then you can still add darker shade. Pero wala masyadong darker shade ngayon. Nadala, guys, nasa kabila mo. Konting-konting lang sa dulo, ha? And then, mascara. That's the last thing that you're gonna apply. Ganun din, ha? Pag nag apply ng mascara, may pag-exhale. Inhale the love. Exhale the drama. O, oh, bagong toddler natin yan, guys, ha? Lagay niyo na lang sa mata niyo yung drama. Huwag na sa heart. Huwag na sa, kat huwag na sa katawan. Okay. Now, if you look closely, here, kita niyo, may bako-bako sa ilalim. Compared here. So, ako, I just like filling up those spaces. I like putting on under the la the the lash line talaga. Because it makes my eyes look bigger and fuller. Alright. Now you can start removing this. Kita niya yan? Ang mga double chin. Dahil, kain pa more. Okay. Kain pa more during lockdown. Yan. So, Contour, contour, sa ilalim ng leeg, ng mukha. So, kung ayaw talaga, na-exercise din ng jaw minsan, guys. <laughs> Nawawala na ang double chin ko. Okay. And then, I also put um, a little bit here. Contour. There. And then I just put on a blush. Kita niyo. May pag smile. So sa smile ka muna tapos swoop up. Tapos normally may pag dayan. Medyo chin down kayo. May kita niyo yun. Yan, yung shape na. Kila nagpapout ka. So yung shape na yun, pataas. Huwag niya nang pag-abutin dun sa nang konti sa konsak, ano. Para, lalo na, para tumaas, may lift ang fez. Tapos super blend, ha? Subtle, subtle lang. Parang hindi masyadong naghanda. Okay. Tapos, Sa lips, normally yan naka-lip balm ka na, diba? Oh, my so, friend gave this to me. Smashbox. Okay. I love using them because it's just easy. And I like them. Like this one, on some days, I wear it alone. And some days, I wear this alone if I have more dramatic eyes. But nowadays, pinagpapatong ko sila. So, this one kasi harang. Ah! Look at me! I'm purple red. Ganyan, parang pinkish. Parang masyadong look at me, diba? So, normally, tamad na talaga ako. Ganyan ka talaga. Sa lahat ng pandadaya ako talaga ng ginagawa. At saka hagtitihid. Sa pagbili ng makeup, yan. So, pwede naman, ganyan na yung lipstick, diba? Parang, lakas makaan. Kita niya talaga, lagpas-lagpas ko maka-emote. Yan na nga. 
So the beauty about makeup, pag nagkamali ka, pwedeng burahin. Pero sa tao, pag nagkamali ka, hirap nilang burahin sa utak eh, no? Wow, hugot yan ha. Yan ang mga hugot ko. Alright. But, since tita na ako, pag mga bagets bagay pa yung mga ganyang color, shocking. Or, there are days na wala lang. Feel ko. Nasa emotions ko talaga kinukuha yung pag may makeup ko minsan or what I'm gonna wear. Then I like when I want to have a happy day then I'll just use this. Pero wala lang makeup na iba. Blush on lang. Tapos yan na. Okay, next. I, this nude color, I put it on top. Ayan natin, masyadong shocking ang lipstick. Kita nyo na. Medyo nag-tone down siya, diba? So, it Kung dadalawa yung shade ng lipstick nyo, pwede nyo pagpatungin yun, guys. To create a different shade. Oh. Diba? So, hindi na siya ganun ka siya. Tapos, pinigay niya ka muna. Tapos, yung hindi natakpan, yun na lang yung lalagyan mo. Tapos, syempre, buburahin mo na naman yung mga lumagpas. Tapos, pag may mga kailangan tanggalin, like yung mga laghas, go, q-tips. Ayan. So, kung happy na kayo dyan, push nyo na yan. Pero kung gusto nyo ng konting nose line, nose line talaga, go, pwede rin. Sige, kung saan kayo masaya, ako medyo masaya ako ng konti sa nose line. Kunti lang naman, guys. So, I start from the eyebrows and then I kind of like put it down a bit. Oops. konting konti lang. Yung hindi halata. Konti lang kasi itagay na tayo kanina. Yeah. Konti lang naman siya. And then that's it. It's a makeup. Okay. Try natin edit yung before and after. Keri. Thank you for watching my video. Please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. You can also check out my other videos and follow me at my Facebook and Instagram.